All right, all right, all right. Hello, everybody. It is Dan Lags, and welcome back to part number 15 of our Skyrim playthrough. Uh, we just left the Skyhaven Temple. Esbern and Delphine are still in there mumbling away at whatever they're talking about. I just left early because I don't want to hear all that nitty-gritty. Like always, I was elected to lead, not to, to read, and I don't want to jump off this cliff. That would be bad. But anyway, um, today we have to go to, I believe, we have to go to... Um, What's that place called again, Lydia? Uh, High Hrothgar, that's right. Uh, it's still telling me that I have to go back inside. I don't really know why it's doing that. But I'm going to look at the map real quick. Here we go. As you can see, my uh, newest quest is to talk to... Whatever that guy's name is. He's at the top of the throat of the world. So, uh, let's see. Where would the throat of the world be? Um, well, let's see here. Somewhere around here somewhere. So, let's go ahead and fast travel. Because I'm lazy. I don't want to walk all over the place. Uh, okay, we're near Markar, so we got to go all the way over here. I'm talking like High Hrothgar. Here we go. All right, everybody. So welcome back. Um, series is going pretty good. I've only died like 15 times, so it's better than I thought I would do. But I thought I would die at least 30 more times. But, uh, you know, I, I can't complain. I really can't. The only thing I can complain about right now is my headset, which has been real butt, I got to say. Um, I, I snapped my headset today. It's a really old headset. It's like four years old, but you know It lived its life and I'm gonna put it into retirement soon But it, it kind of like snapped in half today. So I had to like duct tape it together uh, Before like, you know in the time between you know using this and then ordering a new one Which I already did so ordered a brand new headset the exact same model Because I don't like change and I just figured I would just get an exact reincarnation of it. I did the same thing so with a uh, my headset in the past like it'll be like my third version of the x11 turtle beach anyway let's get back on topic here so uh i gotta find this this uh mage guy somewhere where do you think he is oh, i see a little arrow i see a little arrow i see an arrow oh there he is i'm gonna sneak thank you know, super sneaky super sneaky yeah i can pickpocket him And try to come in for the come in for the pickpocket. Oh, I'm hidden. You don't know I'm here. Ha ha. He's got cabbage. That's it. Oh my goodness. All right, bud. I'm here. Ah, you've retrieved the horn of oh. Jorgen Wimkel. Yes, I have. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. I like how <laughs> I've like did like a whole bunch of other stuff. Wait, can I like steal? That's right. Keep walking. You're nerd. I'm gonna steal your crap. Okay, here we go. Potion of regen. Yes. Potion of regeneration. Yes. Any other goodies that Dan could steal? Like this potion of health? Heck yeah. Oh. They all they just keep coming for me. I'm gonna take all your stuff. I'm with the blades now. Wait, wait, where'd he go? Oh. Man, confusing confusing floor plan you got here, guys. You are ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da. Which means push. Are you telling me I'm going to be able to say through throw da? Oh, heck yeah. Here we go. I'm so pumped for this. With all three words together, this shall... Let me foosh row da. Let me foosh row da. Yes. Give me your knowledge, Wolfgar. You got a cool name, by the way. I think I said that before. Hold on. Let me turn down my game volume, guys. Alright. Can I push it off somebody? Completed your training, Dragonborn. We would speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. If you can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeards. But you I think I can handle the voice of you hags. Oh my god. You guys still got it. You guys still got it. I don't know what you're saying. What the hell are you guys saying? Ah, earthquake! Evacuate the building! Ring the fire alarm! Lydia, do something! They're speaking to raise weird language to me and I can't move! Ah! I don't understand. I'm gonna try to decipher this. 
Oh, wait, never mind. The text went away. Oh, here we go, here we go. May, no. Ismer. Dova, I'm gonna assume that's Dragonborn. What month do you want? I don't know. You have tasted the voice of the Greybeards. I don't know. I would I would consider that more of a um, a tan kind of like rusty, dirty blonde color. What the hell? What the? What? What? Uh, he teleported. Oh, yeah. Am I supposed to follow you now? Let me ask. Wind, guide you. Oh okay. 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 Oh okay. Sky above, voice within. Did you hear that? Sky above, voice within. Those are words to live by. Yeah. Let's keep going. Am I supposed to follow you? I don't know. Oh wait, maybe I should ask him a question. Sky, got you. I need a shout. Learn to beat Alduin. Blah, more to the voice. Blah, 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 blah. Here we go. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? Oh god, he's figuring me out. Uh. Yes. For matters of such gravity, we need to know where you stand, or who you stand with. Ooh. If you wish to stand alone, so be it. If you wish for our help, you will answer my question. Huh. He's backing me into a Where corner. did you learn of a shout used to defeat Alduin? Uh, okay, I'm gonna go like that. The blades, of course. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their mm. reckless arrogance knows no bounds. They have always sought to turn the dragonborn from the path of wisdom. Didn't know this guy could be so you salty. Learned nothing from us. Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the blades to be used for their own purposes? The blades are helping me, but I'm not their puppet. The blades just want to defeat Alduin, don't you? At least the blades aren't keeping secrets from me. Uh, this one. No, no, of course not. Forgive me, Dragonborn. I have been intemperate with you, but heed my warning. The blades may say they serve the dragonborn, but they do not. They never have. No, I cannot teach it to you, because I do not know it. Ooh. It is called Dragonrend, but its words of power are unknown to us. You guys. I do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. All right. I thought you knew all the powers, uh, what's up, Avatar Queen? But not Dragonrend. The knowledge of that shout was lost in the time before history began. Perhaps only its creators ever knew it. But I am not the one to speak of it to you. Uh, this guy doesn't know anything. Only Parthenax, the master of our order, can answer that question, if he so chooses. Oh yeah, now we're talking. Why haven't I met Parthenax yet? I need to speak to Parthenax. He is our leader. He surpasses us all in his mastery of the way of the voice. Okay. He lives in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. He speaks to us only rarely and never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him is a great privilege. Oh. Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Yeah. I should get some levels up for my speech there. I just convinced this guy to help me out. Are you going to walk? Lydia, step aside. Let him through. Thank you, Lydia. You slave. Let's go. Let's follow him. All right. Come on, bud. I don't got all day. In fact, I'm just gonna go outside and hope he just like teleports to me randomly. Opening up the High Hrothgar courtyard. Oh, you know what? I should silence my phone. You know what's gonna happen, everybody. Watch me get a text. Okay. Well, Lydia's out here. At least she knows what she's doing. I bet you I could just run through, no problem. I mean, I'm the freaking dragonborn. I can do whatever the heck I want. Yeah, now this looks dangerous. Oh, yeah, 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 okay, yeah, you win. You win. Terrible force of wind that I can't control. You win. Jump! Alright. 
Are you gonna... Okay, okay. He's gonna keep walking. <laughs> Go for it. Oh, hello. Oh, okay, the whole squad is, is walking up to the club. Okay. To Parthenax lies through this gate. I will show you how to open the way. All right, bud. Show me already. You guys are slower than than a graveyard. Actually, that doesn't make sense. Oh, okay. I don't want you right on the ground. Just give me like a piece of paper or something. Okay, he's t teaching me more vocabulary. Spelling class is fun. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, here we go. I will grant you my understanding of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. Oh, thank you very much, failure. Clear skies will blow away the mist. But only for a time. The path to Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal, and you will reach the summit. All right, thank you. Appreciate it. Let's do this, Lydia. All right, this is watch Lydia die going through this. All right, here we go. We gotta go to our magic. Gotta go to our shouts. Clear skies, and Fusro Da as well. So that's cool. Uh, let's just blow away the... Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Come on, Lydia, run! I don't know where I'm going. I'm gonna keep running, though. Not really sure what's going on up here. I'm just gonna keep going. Hey, the goat! How'd you get through? He must be a dragonborn goat. Still getting hurt by this stuff. How's Lydia doing? She's so screwed. Am I like... Oh, 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 I didn't see this. Okay. Okay, the goat died. Poor goat. Okay, let's restore health. Hopefully Lydia can catch up. Oh god, Lydia might have, might have gotten wrecked by that windstorm. Oh, there she goes. Lydia, you beast. Alright, let's keep going. Whoa, what the heck is this thing? I have no idea what this is. Ice reef? Where the heck is Sorry, I'm not trying to hit you, Lydia. I'm just trying to hit this thing that's like floating in the air. I can't even keep up with it. It's dead. Okay, let's keep going. Come on, Lydia. No time to waste on this mountain. We're going up to the throw of the world. Got another one of these things. I'm not really sure why I just use my... This thing is weak as heck. It's hard to hit, though. Let's probably get up my uh, sword out instead of this mace. Is it dead? Yeah, it's dead. Alright, let's keep going. Restore health. Come on, Lydia. I think I'm going in the right direction. Who knows? I'm not really sure how this part works. I don't remember this part. Hey, there's another goat. Dead. Alright, yeah, and I'm gonna switch out uh, the mace for the blade sword. Just so it's, I can swing a little bit faster. Alright. So... I can't imagine we got much further to go. Than the least things. Where'd you go? This thing's hard to hit. Keep eyes on target. Alright. I think I got this restoration on. How close am I leveling up? Pretty close. Alright, we're making some progress here, guys. I don't really remember this part of the game too well, to be honest. This is, uh... Oh, from a while ago. So. I think we're getting really close, though. A little... The, the wind blowing off the sand. Uh... I think one time I tried to, like, get all the way up to the top of the throw of the world and then, like, try to scale down to the ground without dying. I don't think it ended well. Don't try that at home, kids. Yeah, we got to be getting pretty close here. There's another one of those, like, clear sky things. 
I think I just heard another goat. Those goats know how to clear the skies. There we go. Let me through. Hopefully Lydia will catch up. I have confidence in Lydia. She's she's been a good partner for this for this series. Here we go. We are here at the throat of the world. Now where's Parthenax? Oh, there he is. Spoiler alert, he's a dragon. <laughs> Drem Yolok, greetings, Wundanik. I am Parthenax. Oh, I'm a, I'm a Wundanik? Is that some sort of like... Who are you? What brings you to my Strunmach, my mountain? Oh. I wasn't expecting you to be a dragon. Yeah. I am as my father Akatosh made me, as are you, Dovakin. <laughs> Tell me, why do you come here? How does he know I'm a dragonborn? Why do you intrude on my meditation? Uh hmm. Drem patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the dove. Whatever that means, you're sound like Yoda with his cryptic speak. I can't understand what you're saying. By long tradition, the elder speaks first. I'm older than you. Hear my thumb. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dova King. Okay, so Shaifu's row. Oh, here we go. Okay. Give me your thing. Can I click on it? Do I do I click it? Here we go. Fire breath. Cool. I guess he dragon or dove or just dragons. Always giving me his power. Thank you, bud. You're a good dragon. Except you're old as hell. You can't fight any other now, dragon. Show me what you can do. Greet me not as mortal, but as Dova. Uh, okay, so he wants me to use fire breath on him. Okay. Fire breath. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. He loves that. Fire breath all over my face. <laughs> It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. <laughs> oh, there he goes. Bye. Oh, never mind. He's just moving. Oh, he looks much more badass up there. Yeah, no doubt. So, you have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova Sauce, dragon blood. Whatever that means. What would you ask of me? Oh yeah, finally you're speaking English. Here we go. Can you teach me the dragon wrench shout? Question mark. Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No. You seek your weapon against Alduin. Oh yeah, you understand. Um, how did you know I came for Dragonrend? Whoever it's won't... Uh... Yeah. Alduin Comate Teed. What else would you seek? Alduin and Dovakin return together. But I do not know the thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. I think Croesus is one of the dragon priest names, Your and I think that's like some sort of like swear word, like fish paste in Spongebob. It as a weapon it's like Croesus. Or like, like I would say dragons. like crap or something like that. He would say Croesus. I don't know, that might just be spitballing. minds cannot even comprehend its concepts. Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this thum? Ooh, he's putting the pressure on me. <laughs> That's none of your business. Sips tea. <laughs> um, 
I need to stop Alduin. I like this world. I don't want to end. <laughs> uh, I'll go with that. Yes, Alduin. Zembach. The elder brother. Gifted, grasping, and troublesome. As is so often the case with firstborn. But why? Why must you stop Alduin? Oh, we put a lot of emphasis on you. Mm, true, but Kostid I got all the answers. Tells what may be, not what should be. Touche. Kostid Salo Ak. Just because you can do a thing does not always mean you should. Do you have this no guy is just gonna lecture me all day. Than destiny? Are you nothing but a plaything of Dez, of fate? Okay, he's making a lot of assumptions here. I'm starting to get a little bit pissed off. You know, I've killed about ten dragons in this game so far, bud. And you're pretty old. You're like the grandpa dragon. I'll take, kick your butt. Let me see. Let me see these options. I didn't come to your debate philosophy with you. <laughs> a better reason to act for it. Ba ba ba. I'm destiny, but I will stop all of it. Uh, I like this one. <laughs> <laughs> you have much to learn of the dove, then. There is nothing else but philosophy to a dova. It is no accident that we do battle with our thum, our voices. <laughs> there is no distinction between It's like they yell at each other, what is the meaning of life? Is the Bing Bang Theory the beginning of the universe? They just yell at each other the whole time, that's how they fight. For us, it is one and the same. But you have oh indulged my, God, my this guy. for speech long enough. Croesus, now I will answer your question. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monavin, what you name Throat of the World? No, dragons like mountains, right? <laughs> mm, true, <laughs> but few Damn it, you figured me out. that this was the very spot where Alduin was defeated by the ancient tongues. You don't say. Varucht Unslad. Perhaps none but me now remember how he was defeated. Mm, yes and no. Viknuzni Karon. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to dot, dot, dot. defeat him. <laughs> the Nords this guy of talks those forever. days used the dragon rend shout to cripple Alduin, but this was not enough. Oak Mulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Fancy. I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Mm, how to explain in your tongue? The Dove have words for such things that Jaw do not. Oh, from the Jaw. It is an artifact from outside time. It does not exist. But it has always existed. Ah, uh. oh, They are mm, fragments of creation. Why well, you gotta make things so complicated? The it's on the box of the game. Elder scrolls, as you name them, they have often been used for prophecy. Yes, your prophecy comes from an elder scroll. But this is only a small part of their power. Zofa Suryek. Mm, not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever. Forever lost. Maye. I need. I must give some of this a little bit. Because it's like, this is ridiculous. 
print. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient... If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the... With the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. I think it's like hilarious. Like, you could. Learn I would love to meet the dude who did the voiceover for this dragon. It's like, yeah, what's your day job? Well, you know, I just voice over for dragons. It's like this dude's voice is like freaking amazing. Okay, uh, I know where I can find an Elder Scroll. Krosis. No, I know little of what has like passed below in the long I'm start using years that, like, I have lived here. Be super nerdy. Be like, you oh, are likely God. better Krosis. informed than I. Hmm, Esper and Argo might have an idea. Trust your instincts, Dovakin. Your blood will show you the way. Okay, that's pretty creepy. Okay. It says optional talk to Esbern or optional talk to or blah, 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 blah. Okay, all this other stuff I don't need to Okay. Bye but Dream your look. Greetings. Soon I'm gonna back up slowly. Alright. So that was a really long and long winded conversation with the dragon, but you know, you gotta have those every once in a while. Um who should I talk to? Esborn? Or should I talk to the blah blah blah. I like Esborn better. TBH. So let's go over. Let's go back over to uh, the Skyhaven Temple here. All right. That's an awesome shield. I wish I had Daedric artifacts. One day. One day I'll have them. Probably not. <laughs> I'm not. I can't smith things. One day I'll try smithing. I said I was gonna do it at the beginning, and I just kind of like forgot about it. But I mean, let's go talk to Esborn. Hopefully he's still here. I imagine he's probably still here. Level 10. Alright. Yoo-hoo, I'm back! Anybody home? Is anybody here? Uh... Okay, are they just like not here? That's weird. He's gotta be in here somewhere. Where are you, bud? Maybe he's chilling in here. Oh, look at this. I didn't even know this was here. <gasps> Got a bunch of chests I can steal from. Yes, please. I would have. If I would have seen this earlier, I would have jumped all over this. Got a bunch of chests in here. A little bit of gold never hurts. I took that cast iron pot while I'm at it. Oh, leather strips. Don't mind if I take all of those. Could use those for some smithing at a later date. All right, we got the last couple of chests right here. Saber cat pellet. I should take that with me so I look like I'm. Better than I am, because I couldn't kill a saber cat for my life. Alright, I don't think Esborn is here. Or, uh, what's that girl's name? Delphine? I don't think that she's here either. Alright, we got a chest. Oh! Okay, I did not see this stuff. Let's take this. Okay. I'm over encumbered. We got the blade shield. Heavy boots. Blade gauntlets. I'm just gonna take all this stuff. Then I'll just figure out how to get rid of this stuff, so. Uh, let's, let's get rid of some apparel. Ah, I hate these stupid shields. They 24 dead weight. Okay, um, let's see what I have on right now. Let's kind of just evaluate. Alright, so I have light armor boots, which are 8. These things are 18, and they're... Okay, these things are really, really light, and these are really heavy. But they give me so much more protection. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. I think I'm going to go with this stuff, because plus it looks kind of cool. Okay. There we go. I can store. I can store that. I can store that. I can store that. 
Um, let's just try to get rid of some stuff that's heavy. We'll figure it out, guys. Um, okay, I have this thing on right now. 25. And it increases my thing by 40. But this can increase by 60. I think I'll go with that. Same with the helmet. I think I'll just rock the whole the whole armor set up here. With the blade sword as well. Alright, can I get rid of any of this stuff? Um, I gotta keep my mace. Okay, I'm, I'm 29 above this. Okay, I'm gonna... Nope, unfavor that. Okay, I'm gonna store this. I know where this stuff is here, so... Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of that pickaxe. I just don't need to carry that. It's such dead weight. All these stabs I want to keep, and they're not that heavy. Oh. If I, if I drop the axe, I'm good. <laughs> Wait, what's this stuff? Oh, Dragon Bane? Heck yeah. Uh, I'm... Okay, I'm back over encumbered again. Wait, what's Dragon Bane? Um... 20 extra points of dragon. Shock damage to everybody else. I don't know if that's, like, better than the sword I have. It probably is. So I'll keep it. Let me see if I can find something else I can drop. Is there anything that's, like, really, really heavy that I didn't even realize I'm holding? Oh, dragon bones. Okay. Let's put some dragon bones in this chest. I'm a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know this stuff is here. I can come back for it later. It's not like it's going to get stolen inside here. Okay, uh... Store, 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 store. Okay, I'm pl I'm way under encumbered now, so that's great. Alright, so check out the, the new the new Dangar setup here. Okay, hold on. I just spin myself around. Oh, yeah. I'm a little bit slower now. I guess I got heavier armor, but... Um... I think it'll be worth it, because I can actually like, run around and kill people better, so... Let's get that dragon bane sword out. Actually, I might keep it just for dragons. But yeah, I don't think Esburn's here. So I'm gonna have to go find him somewhere else. Maybe he went outside. Okay, let me just put away my stuff so I can run faster. Again, I added a lot of weight to myself with this heavy armor, so... Um, I'm gonna be a little bit slower. Some of my stamina's gonna lower quicker. But, you know, obviously I'm gonna have a lot more damage in battle. I might even consider just running around with no armor on for, like, long runs. And then, you know, quickly putting it on before a fight. You know, I could always just do that. It takes a little bit more time, but it is pretty effective. We'll see. See if I can even find Esburn. I don't even know where he is. If I can't find him, I'll just go to the other guy. Open sesame. Oh, they're there. Okay, cool. Figured they were outside. Alright, let's talk to this guy. I used to dream of it. Ah, you're back. I hope you've made some progress on tracking down this shout we need to defeat Alduin. Ah, indeed. And there's a pretty puzzle. Not the kind of thing you will find in your local bookshop. Let me think. Perhaps the College of Winterhold, what learning there is in Skyrim, is gathered there. One of the mages there may be able to put you on the trail of this Elder Scroll. Okay. All right. So then came the flash of light just on the horizon. The clouds that marked the. Did you need something? Do you know the College of Winterhold? They have a deep interest in such arcana. All right. Well, I think. Uh, then. Now I guess I can go to to Winterhold. It's gonna be a new place to go. Oh yeah, it is telling me to go there. Okay. So, there's a couple of ways I could get there. Obviously, it's pretty far off from anywhere else I've been. Um, really, the closest way I could go is either just go to Dawnstar or go to Windhelm and then travel from there. Um, I think I'll go to here, travel to Dawnstar, and then travel to Winterhold. That's, what, that's my plan. Alright, so let's fast travel to the Highgate Ruins. Uh, once we arrive at Dawnstar, guys, we'll uh, conclude today's video, and then I'll... Uh, start back up next next episode with uh, moving over to Winterhold. Um, we're getting towards like some of the really interesting stuff in the uh, in the quest, like going to Blackreach, which is I think where you get the Elder Scroll eventually. Uh, it's a really really cool area. It looks like you're underwater, it, even though it's like not underwater. So it's pretty cool. Um, okay, so in order to get to where I want to go, I need. To, well, hold on. Let me just make sure I'm going on the right track here. Alright, so I kind of just have to follow this coastline, that's fine. And actually, I'm going to do exactly what I said a minute ago. 
and just kind of unequipped everything. I'm going to favorite all this stuff and then unequip it real quick. So, and if I want to like re-equip it, like right now I'm like totally bare, bare nude. But if I want to re-equip it, I can just simply go to, um, wait, hold on. What do I go to again? I guess items and I, oh yeah, just go under favorites. Okay. So that's my, that's my plan. All right. What's this guy want? Take this and hold on to it. I'll be back for it later. I'll pay you good. Don't lose it. No time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I'll kill you right now. Back up, man. That's right. Step back from the Dangar. Weirdo. Oh god, spider. Oh god. I think I can kill these guys without armor. Honestly, there's spiders. See someone run past just now. Oh. Haha. <laughs> well, if you do, grab him and yell. Bastard stole from me. <laughs> See you later, bud. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh oh. Okay. Sneaky. I don't want to fight that thing right now. I really don't. Let's get to Dawnstar and quick. Probably a frost dragon, knowing where I am. Oh god. I think it's a blood dragon just looking at its wings and its tail. Let's try to sneak up along the coast and try to avoid this thing. Don't you don't see me. Uh oh. We got some wolves over here too. Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, even with that armor, these things don't stand a chance. This is a kind of a dangerous area, so I probably should have armor on. But if I ever see, if I see something really threatening, I'll I'll put it on right away, because you do have the luxury of randomly, you know, freezing time and putting all your stuff on, which is great. If that wasn't the case, this game would be a lot more difficult. Okay, so let me just see if I'm on the right track here. Oh yeah, I'm head straight forward. Okay, cool. There's another wolfie. Come at me, bro. Oh, oh! The naked cutscene. All oh, right. Let's put away my sword. I look so like pathetic, walking through the middle of like a tundra, with no clothes on. <laughs> Somebody's dumb. Luckily for me, my stamina goes up real quick. All right, we're gotta be getting pretty close to Dawnstar here. I can see it on the map now. Oh my God, is that a frost troll? Are you kidding me? I'm so tempted to take this thing on because I hate these things so much and it would be so satisfying to kill one. Should I try to hit it from a distance with the, with the, uh, yes, you know what? Guys, we're ending this episode off with a fight with the frost troll. All right. I need to kill this thing. Okay, here we go. Let's just line it up right here and see if I can, okay, let's see if I can get this shot on here. Okay, I'm really going to make sure I line this up. Got to be real, real careful on the sticks here. Okay, that should be good. All right, here we go. Here we go, S nice and steady. All right, just a little bit over. There we go. Did I hit it? Let me aim a little bit higher. Uh oh. Why are my bows going limp? There we go. Where's he going? Am I hitting him? I guess not. Just gotta aim a little bit higher. Is stupid. He doesn't see me. There we go. Got him. All right, Dan. Bow skills. Bow skills. Okay, he sees me. Okay, Lydia. This is time. This is our moment, Lydia. Okay, let me put my stuff on. Okay, equip. 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 Okay. Uh, and the mace. Okay. It's time. Come at me, bro. Right, I'm gonna go in for like, a quick hit on him. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, yep, okay. God, these guys do so much damage. Even when I'm, like, play through the game so much further, these guys still wreck me. Okay. Potion of healing. Potion, a couple of potions of health. Alright, there we go. All I needed was that. I got him. Cutscene! Yeah! That's right! 
Give me your gold. Give me your arrows. Heck yes. Alright. I killed one of those things finally. Those things are still so strong. Alright, let's get the Dawnstar, guys. God, that makes me happy that I killed that thing. Dangar conquered, finally conquered a frost troll. That makes me so happy. 40 minutes into the video. This has been a long episode. A lot half of it was Parthenax just rambling on about something stupid. Alright, here we are in Dawn's Tower. So, with that, guys, I'm going to conclude today's video. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Uh, we're getting kind of close to Winterhold, me and Lydia, but we're going to take some refuge here in Dawnstar to, uh, you know, in between episodes. And we'll start off next time uh, heading towards the Winterhold. So, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you guys next time. Peace out. God, my character looks awesome.